So Larink and I have been planning on getting e-bikes for quite a while and we've been talking about it and looking at budgets and everything else. We came across the fifth wheel e-bikes uh, watching another channel. So we've decided to go ahead and pull the trigger for Black Friday and we ordered them on a big Black Friday sale and they're here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put them together and get them all charged up and we'll let you know our thoughts on it. As you can see, everything's packed in there pretty good. Keeping everything safe. All right. So the first thing you gotta do is get the bike. And now, like I said, you got all this packing material. So we're just gonna go around and start cutting cables. Now be careful, because a lot of these plastic cables are wrapped around the wires and obviously you don't want to cut the wires. They come pretty installed and pretty put together right from the get-go. You just got to put the handlebars together, the seat together, put the front tire on, air up the tires, and that's about it. Looks like a daunting job, but it's really not. I am really impressed with the way these things are packed up, uh, keeping them nice and safe, not getting banged around. A couple little scuff marks, but not that big a deal, considering I'm pretty sure these are made overseas. We'll keep working on it. Now just keep grabbing bike parts and pulling on them and <laughs> see where your packing material is. So it comes with a little accessory kit, a little tool set, front headlamp, pedals, a belt, instruction booklet, and the battery charger. Alright, so we're going to finish getting it put together and charge them up and go have some fun. Alright, there she is, all put together. We're going to take a little spin around the RV park real quick and make sure the seat elevation and everything else is set up. And then once the route gets home, we'll show you guys how they all work out for us. I know, that's just some that, that's just like if you're cruising. Alright, so what do we think so far? I think they're cool. Yeah? I can't believe how fast they go. I know. And we've just been keeping them on level one, huh? Yeah. I would have to get out, like, we'd have to get out, um... Like, wide open? Yeah, where you can just go. I mean, these mm -hmm. are long streets, but... Right. Because we're getting to know them, I'm not... I don't want yeah. to go too fast. No, I agree. And we don't have helmets yet. Yes. We, we know be, we don't have helmets. We're going to be getting them. We're just yeah. testing them out right now. Should we get helmets? Leave us a comment down below <laughs> and let us know. Yes. We, Everybody's going to say yes. Helmets. These are awesome. Mm hmm I really like them. They feel sturdy and yep we got two of the fifth wheel brand thunder one ft ft for fat tire um yeah we've had them for a little while we've ridden 1.1 miles on them so far and yeah we're we're really happy with them Uh, first off, we bought our helmets. <laughs> <laughs> we weren't even going to wait for all the comments to come in. Uh, so we went out and we bought helmets uh, this morning. Well, we said we were going to do that. Yeah, we, we knew we were going to, but we figured that, you know, riding these, riding the bikes outside of the RV park, we should probably have have our helmets. Because they get up and go. Yeah. And if something were to happen, you would want to have a helmet on. We're very happy with the fifth wheel e-bikes. Again, these are the Thunder One fat tires. Mm -hmm. um, they've got three different uh, pedal assist speeds, and then they've got a throttle. I think it's three miles an hour. Once you hit three miles an hour, the pedal assist kicks in, and then you can hit the throttle. And then you can actually just almost ride it like a go-ped. You know, without it, without having to pedal at all, which is, it's neat, but obviously, you know, if 
you're on a bicycle, you're trying to get a little bit of exercise in. So I don't use that one a whole heck of a lot, do you? No. All right, we're taking our new e-bikes out here uh, to Lost Dutchman State Park. And just because we can ride a little bit further than in the RV park and kind of see, test them out, feel, you know, get the feel of them. Um, so far, really like it. It's nice and open out here. We have beautiful view of the Superstition Mountains. And we can just kind of, like I said, get the feel of the bikes. So far, so good. I really like them. They're very comfortable. Uh, I like the big tires. I feel like they kind of grab, uh, you know, what's down below. You feel a little like, I, I feel more secure on them. So how are we doing? Good. It's fun. Oh, yeah. Especially after a couple days just in the RV park getting used to it and getting used to all the levels. Yeah. You know, the level one assisted pedaling is really good, especially for these hills. Yeah. I felt it kick in when we went off the road. Yeah. I had to go a little more uphill. Yep. So, um, yeah, it's kind of fun to get out in the open. Right. And kind of just see what they can do. So then you kind of learn about yeah. your bike. Absolutely. Lost Dutchman State Park does hold a special place for us. <laughs> it's where we had our first shakedown trip in the RV when we bought it. Probably 14 months ago was our first trip. It was Halloween weekend. We were here for Halloween on our first shakedown trip. Well, we love the Superstition Mountains. Yes. And we love this side of it. So right. the park we're at right now, there's a beautiful view as well, but it's not this side of it. So yes. when we come here, it's, I don't know. It's special. It is. It is. If you guys haven't seen that video yet, I'll put it right here. And you can go back and check out our first ever shakedown trip in the RV here at the beautiful Lost Dutchman State Park. Yeah. They are just a lot of fun to ride around on. You pedal to get your exercise, but you've also got the pedal assist to help you out up and down the hills. It's good. It's a lot of fun. They're great, you know. And again, shipping was fast. We got ours for a pretty good deal. We've actually got a discount code for you all. So our discount code is RRT130. I'll go ahead and write it down right there. And you get $130 off on the Fifth Wheel E-Bikes uh, website. I, I, I really like them. They feel very sturdy, which yes. I like. I'm sure they're heavier than their smaller bikes that they mm -hmm. have. So it depends on how you're able to store them, how you're able to tow them, carry them, whatever. So we're gonna break the bikes down and put them in the back of the truck and show you how easy this is. There's a little lever right here. Flip the lever and then you just kind of fold it in half. Pull down the lever on the handlebars. This folds in half. And then the whole thing, the whole thing folds up like a suitcase right here. Here's the battery in here. Um, we don't need to take the battery out so that stays locked in there with the key. And then we just pick her up and put her in the truck. Yeah, I think they weigh just under 60 pounds. And obviously my truck is a little bit higher up. So it's a little bit more, a little bit more to get up in the air. But yeah, folds up nice and tight. I'll show you once I get the other one up here, I'll show you how we pack them in here. Okay, as you can notice, they both fit right in there nice and tight. I do have a little bungee cord holding them up, but you know, we should be pretty good. You know, easy to transport, easy to fold up. Again, they're not as lightweight as we thought they would be. They're probably just under 60 pounds, I think, but hey, they're worth it. We I love think them. that's the reason, though, we like them because they feel sturdy when you ride them. Yes. Versus now, we've not ridden the small ones, so we can't say that. Right. But it's from, I feel like the little bit of the weight is why mm -hmm. we like them probably with the tires. Yeah, they're, they're, they're sturdy with the fat tires and everything else. We really like them. So again, if you're interested, you know, Fifth Wheel E-Bikes is the website. I'll go ahead and list the exact website down here. And RRT 130 for $130 coupon off of your purchase of e-bikes. All right, enjoy everybody, we're gonna.